I don't think I ever imagined finding myself in the position of, of telling people to stay home on election day. But Green Bay Mayor Eric Gendrick says it's the best option for your health and safety to prevent the spread of COVID-19. The deadline to receive your absentee ballot has been extended to 5 p.m. this Friday, but the city's clerk's office still has a lot of work to do to get those ballots out ahead of Tuesday's primary election. I think we're over 16,500 a uh, total request. Unfortunately, we still have around 7,000 that are pending. But now you've been given extra time. The deadline for voters to get absentee ballots to local clerks had been 8 p.m. on Tuesday. That's now been changed to 4 p.m. on April 13th. The city is also dealing with a massive shortage of poll workers. We started out at 270 poll, poll workers for this election, which is typical for, for this kind of an election. Unfortunately, we're down to 17. Uh, folks who are still committed to participating and you know I don't blame anybody honestly for dropping out of this but it, it makes it a real challenge for us to administer an election uh, when you've seen your your number of poll workers drop nearly by 95 percent right. Gendrick says because of the shortage the city has considered reducing the amount of polling locations. So in all likelihood uh, you know a couple gymnasiums in the city of Green Bay. Those gyms include Green Bay East and West High Schools only. And today is also the last day for in-person absentee voting in Green Bay. You can cast your vote at the Metro Transit Station off of University Avenue from 10 a.m. to 5 o'clock this evening.